you can just try in 500 acres you have 200 that they just grow uh, the maple trees so okay. all these products are basically like very farm to glass so this is the policy from the whistle pig you know? okay they they want to do everything like homemade and they're very proud of the product that they have there in vermont in the usa okay. so this one i can tell you with the pancakes or how we do uh, the whistle pig old-fashioned but it's good it's for the desert sorry the whiskey is good for desert yeah 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 but this one is a giant what about this one of course yeah the 12 years old what is this? Is a... So this is the, the right whiskey. Whiskey? That was, yeah, yeah, that the whistle pig started well. From okay. US? Yes. Uh -huh, okay. so, so this bad guy here, mm -hmm. it's finished in three different um, wine barrels. Okay. So it's 6-7% uh, in the port wine after the port wine barrel. Then we have Madeira and Sontaneres. So uh, the flavor, the rye right whiskey, the grain, if you have like um, Right, obviously the barley, uh, and then the finish with those cask, you know, giving the extra flavor. So they are giving a color, they are giving a taste, okay. uh, and all those, you know, balance between and whiskey and, and uh, uh -huh, okay. yeah. So that's supposed to be perfect. It's it's right. Right. But I never seen uh, this mark. Uh, Sorry, I never seen this uh, brand. Uh, oh, it's it's quite new also in Norway. So I think maybe a year. Uh, very short with the uh, Chandon, so that's the reason the new brand product, you know. Okay. And we want to put this uh, also into a lot of bars, okay. so it's perfect to mixing. Mm -hmm. But it's also good if you have a cigar or a glass of, uh, of uh, okay. black tea, you know, or something. Yeah. So uh, it is something new. It's very good and premium brand. Okay. okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Little freezer, of course. How much cost in the shops? Well, I would say around 1,600 in the North. 1,600, so expensive. Yes, yeah, it's quite expensive. Yeah. Okay. But oh, again, fantastic. It's, sorry. Fantastic. It's, it is. Oh, it is beautiful. So uh, they buying the. They started with this product in 2015. Okay. And in 2015, they. Are you familiar with it? Yeah. 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 The the BS and you know the the preparation for making a cognac. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Good. It's nice. One. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's super nice. My favorite, all, all the time. Yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, it's really nice. You, you usually buy it yourself? Yeah, yeah, buying a lot of time. Yeah. And yeah, I'm traveling all the time buying it. Yeah. It's really nice to always have, you know, the fruitiness that brings out, and it's really, you know, it's, it's yeah. a bit different compared to the Norwegian one that you have from Raw Start. It's a little bit more in depth, and of course, yeah, yeah. the heritage from yeah. from the 1765, you know. Yeah. And the funny part with Hennessy is that it's one of the largest sellers when it comes to the Eau de Vies yeah. in order to mix and blend. So that's mm. why they have, you know, a consistency yeah. from a very old age, meaning they need to always to have the, the full range with it to, yeah. in order to create, you know, the same kind of cognac year after year after year. Yeah. It's uh, super nice. Yeah. Just from maple syrup. The ma maple okay. syrup, yeah. So they produce in the maple syrup itself. And you can feel it's a lot of flavor in there. Oh. It's very intense. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Nice. <laughs> and this one, it's uh, like you can see, it's 299 in the You can just order it through the page. Uh huh. So uh, yeah, I mean. Yeah, it's feel it uh, maple syrup. Oh I mean, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. The pancakes. Very thick one. Are so good, How many sir? percent alcohol? No, zero. Zero alcohol. Zero alcohol. Okay. So we have the rye whiskey straight rye, hundred percent. And then we have this uh, finish in the cask uh, after wines, but this is just a maple syrup, you know? Aha, yeah. uh -huh, okay, okay. So, uh, nice. I mean, I, I get crazy with this one. And again, pancakes with this or any cocktail, like we have the, the old fashioned maple. So we're mixing those two with orange bitter. Uh -huh. It's a putting a whiskey on the next level. Oh, okay. really? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So it is for the collectors as well. And like you said, see, you know, on the bottle, and the box that you're getting the bottle with, you know, yeah, yeah. it is quite um, luxury, I would say. Uh -huh. So they even mentioned in their uh, report, mm -hmm. so the report about the luxury and premium stuff, they mentioned about the whistle pig itself, the 12 years old, amazing product, really. Is, uh, which country? Uh, USA, Vermont. USA. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So they started the cooperation with Canadians uh, whiskey. So we can know uh, Jim Beam, for example. Mm -hmm. So Beam and Sontori, they bought the first grain from them and they started producing this product. You know? okay, okay. So basically from 2015, yeah. they're going crazy high with the sales and... Uh,